masked man climbed out the window without hesitation. He climbed down the pipe when he entered the poisonous gas. He took a sharp intake of breath and ran down. Because they were trapped on the top floor by the gas, this gas seems harmless enough. But if you inhale it, you'll suffocate to death. And his daughter's ventilator was running out of battery. He had to rush downstairs to change the batteries for his daughter. He went downstairs to his neighbor's house to get an oxygen tank. But when he got here, he saw that his neighbor was already dead. He didn't have time to grieve. He rushed to look for the oxygen tank because he couldn't hold on much longer. Luckily, he found an oxygen cylinder in a corner. So he put on his mask and opened the valve. Until this moment, the man came back to life. Thinking of his daughter's life, the man did not think too much. He put the oxygen cylinder into his bag and carried it on his back. Then he went home and saw his daughter. After replacing her battery with a spare, he even thoughtfully brought her some supplies. But these batteries won't last long. He had to get out to find more batteries for his daughter. But as soon as he got out, the man found dead bodies all over the place. Looking at the dead men on the ground, he hurriedly covered his mask. But within a few steps, he saw a large troop approaching. But when he inquired, he found out that the military was looking for survivors to leave the city together. 